Hello, I'm Illuminate McCauley. Here's your Channel's TV news update for March the 26th, 2021. President Mohamed Buhari is doing his best to resolve the crisis involving farmers and herders in the country. This is according to the Jigawa State Governor, Mohamed Badaru, who stated this on Politics Today, noting that the head of farmer crisis has been brewing for many years owing to the neglect of past leaders. The Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation says it pays between 100 billion and 120 billion naira every month to subsidize premium motor spirit, also known as petrol. NNPC Group General Manager Meli Kiari revealed this at the weekly presidential ministerial media briefing at the State House in Abuja, the nation's capital. Meanwhile, Nigeria has recorded five COVID-19 deaths in the past 24 hours. This is according to the Nigeria Center for Disease Control, which announced this on Thursday night. The new COVID-19 cases were recorded in 14 states and the FCT. On the international scene, at least five people have been killed in Alabama as tornadoes continue to batter the southern U.S. state. Officials say the deaths were in the small town in Calhoun County, where the storm damaged houses and uprooted trees. And in sports, Super Eagles midfielder Wilfred Ndidi says that the Eagles have learned from the mistakes made against Syria alone and are ready to redeem the image of the country when they face the Republic in Porto Novo this Saturday. He understands the expectations from Nigerians and promised that the Eagles will give their all to get a resounding victory. And that's the news update. Please don't forget to join us later for a recap. I'm Alumidia McCauley. Thank you for watching.